Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore. Today I have some more uh, beef jerky to review for you guys. Now this is some more beef jerky from Mikey V's Foods and he is located in Georgetown, uh, Texas. Now that's deep in the heart of Texas. That's a uh, little over halfway between uh, Waco and Austin. So uh, I did review uh, his uh, Island Teriyaki uh, beef jerkies. To, uh, just some awesome products. I'm looking forward to getting into these what he calls the cowboy black pepper and also we're going to be uh, uh, talking about the uh, cowboy reaper from Mikey, B Mikey V's Foods. Alright, now I'm not going to sit here and just eat uh, both of these here in front of me but I want to talk about, uh, we're going to check out the reaper but um, I'll just say that this is some of the best beef jerky I've ever had. Uh, let me go ahead and read the ingredients on the black pepper and then I'll show you what it looks like. Um, Texas made, made with fresh ingredients. Uh, the ingredients we start off with bottom round roast, sweet and savory marinade, uh, which is soy sauce, water, wheat, soybeans, salt, alcohol, sugar, high fructose corn syrup, and what I think really makes these taste so good is that uh, he makes them with Yoshida's Mirin, uh, which is like a rice wine, so just, just awesome. So uh, just check out these uh, Texas size uh, pieces of beef jerky. Uh, look at that black pepper on there. I mean, this is uh, exactly what I love on a beef jerky. It's not too um, dry, but now this one's going to be a little bit more, or it is a little bit more dry than the um, the island teriyaki. Uh, this is the cowboy beef jerky. It's supposed to be a little bit more dry, but this looks exactly like uh, something that uh, a Texas cowboy uh, would have in his pack. But uh, let's go ahead and check out the uh, the reaper one. Now the ingredients are, yeah, the ingredients are the same, uh, but of course this one's got reaper peppers on it, but just take a look at that. Doesn't that look awesome? Just really lean, big fat pieces of beef jerky. And the aroma on this stuff, guys, you know, really beefy, uh, not too salty, not too uh, sweet, but just a real strong, beefy aroma. Let's go ahead and check out the uh, the uh, Cowboy Reaper. Hmm. Yeah, so these are a little bit more dry than the Island Teriyaki. Hmm. Not too chewy. I love the flavor of the black pepper. Um, really, really good. This one, the Reaper, there's no heat so really on the black pepper one, but uh, on the Reaper, it definitely has about a medium burn on it. Mm. This stuff is really, really good. Just look at that. Um, awesome products. I mean, this is really some Texas-style beef jerky. Look at that. Uh, flavor, 10 out of 10 for both of these. Um, on heat, um, like I said, no heat on the regular uh, cowboy black pepper to me, uh, but um, I'd give this a strong 5 out of 10 medium level heat on the uh, cowboy reaper, so it's not extreme. Uh, it's probably going to be pretty darn hot for the average Joe, uh, but for chili heads, probably about in the medium category, but awesome flavor on these. Uh, Mikey, thank you very much for sending them. I really do appreciate it. Everybody check them out. Give them a like on Facebook. And... Uh, don't forget, if you're in Texas, he does have his uh, hot sauce shop that's uh, located at 711 South Main Street, Suite A, right there in Georgetown, Texas. So that's just awesome. All right, stay tuned for more reviews for uh, Mikey B's Foods. And until the next time, enjoy the burn. We'll see you guys later.